Hey, Abby here. Just wanted to share a tool that I came across and have been using for the last couple of months that has just, it has really helped um, propel my business and get content pushed out there quickly. And I love this tool. It's called Machine AI. And there is a link in the description if you want to check that out and just get a free plan. Um, I started with a free plan. What I did is I registered the furry plan, and then what you have to do right here is you have to connect it with your your Open AI API key. So that's not Chat GPT. Um, it's not an upgraded Chat GPT. It's actually Open AI. So what you do is it's the platform.openai.com. Um, this is what it will walk you through, and it actually was super easy. So when you create a free account, the first thing it will say is, hey, go connect it, go connect OpenAI. When you click on it, it gives you clear instructions on how to do that, how to find your secret key, all of that stuff. Once you do that, um, it's super easy to use. Now, one snag I kind of came across is when I tried to connect it, it wouldn't be connect because my OpenAI didn't have any money in it. I was like a tier one or something like that. So I went and deposited um into here there's there's a place on here where i think you can like go to billing and you can deposit like 10 bucks so i put ten dollars in here once i did that it upgraded me to like a tier one or tier two or something like that and then i was able to get my secret key and connect it with open ai and they give really good instructions and machined support as well as open ai support were both very helpful when I messaged them um, just to make sure I was doing everything right. But once that was connected, this thing worked flawlessly. So I, re I really like this. And I did test it with the free account initially. So what this software actually does is if you are writing content or a blog and you want to be able to publish content quickly, this is you can put in a few keywords and then what this will do is it will cluster additional keywords and write articles on it, interlink it all, and get it ready to be published onto your WordPress blog. And I will show you the one that I did. This one over here. So I just started, this is the one I actually used just to quickly test um, on the free account. And I just said, okay, write me in the cluster what I asked it the topic so when you go to create this is what your first cluster it's going to ask you to put in your topic then it's going to ask you who your audience is the language and then if you're on the free version then you have to use autopilot when you hit autopilot you can do 5 10 or 30 articles I think something like that but with the free version you get 15 articles per month so you could just do a quick cluster of five, which is what I did right here with this PLR. All I did was I typed in PLR, PLR digital products, and I said go. What it did was it gave me five different suggestions for articles that it would write for me and then interlink with one another so that when these were ready and written, it would automatically, I'd be able to put these on my WordPress blog and I would be able to, um, you know, obviously you want to edit it a little bit, personalize it, and then publish to your blog. So with a literal click of the button, <laughs> it wrote all of these articles for me and it came up with images, everything like that. Now, one tip, if you're doing this, you want to make sure there's this little tab up here called experimental. You want to make sure that this is on. When I first started this, it was not. And I didn't actually, for the first three articles, I didn't even have humanize on there. And you can see where these check marks are is where I turned it on. So you want to make sure this little tab is ticked over so that you have the humanize feature. And so what this did, so I will actually show you guys this. If you hit read, this will actually come up here. It created this. Uh, image from Dolly. This is revolutionize your business, the impact of PLR digital products. It created, it's a 14 minute read, 3,300 words, and then it went through and it talked all about different PLR digital products. Um, and this basically 
interlinks with all of these other articles right here. So here's the next one. I'll just show this to you. Um, and these are pretty lengthy articles. And now granted, I put the settings for it to be a long post. I was using chat GPT. I was using professional. Now I've tested different voices, different um, perspectives. And then I've also tested like the research and the human eyes. The settings, I'm going to show that. I'm going to create a cluster right here sh and show you the ones um, that I used that, are the, that I find are the best settings. So if we come in here and we, I'll just create one. I'm going to do dogs and then I'm going to say dog costumes and then I'm going to go, let's see, uh, we'll do Halloween costumes we'll do it like that and then i'm going to say people looking to find um let's see halloween costumes for their dog english we're just going to do autopilot and i'm just going to say let's see united states and then I'm going to go with small cluster is going to create five for me. Now, what this is going to do is it's going to suggest keywords for me instead of me putting those in there. Now, what you would have to do is you'd have to upgrade if you want to put your own keywords in there, but it isn't necessarily necessary to do that. So dog Halloween outfits, small dog Halloween costumes, large dog Halloween costumes, Halloween dog costumes, funny dog Halloween costumes. These are all suggestions that they came up with that you could write around. Now it's going to tell you the volume is high, competitive is high, and the trend obviously right now is going up because it's almost October. Um, and I'm actually, I will run one of these just to show you guys, but you want to make sure I always click on prevent duplicate links, interlinking I have enabled, featured images, I always use Dolly, and then I actually leave the image style um, default, and then I may change the color based on what I want. So, you know, with dogs, I mean, I don't, I don't really know, let's see, I'm trying to think of a color with a dog, we could just use, um, let's see, we'll just do gold. Why not? But what I, t what I typically will do is I always put human eyes on the tone of voice. I like using friendly. Now, if you do this up here, it'll change all of the tone to friendly. The model I like to use, I actually like 4.0. And then depending on if you want the main article, you may want to say, okay, I want the main article to be very long. And then what this research, it just depends if I have some research I'd want to put on here. You can turn this on and actually put different URLs. You can actually, you can come in here and you can actually tell it what you want it to scan in order to get relevant data off of your topic. Um, you want to make sure humanize is on. I'm going to turn that one back off. And then... Basically, all you have to do is you can simply click write and it will write this article. Now, I'm not going to write this article right now, but I do want to come over here and show you. So when I wrote, let's see, so I have written all five of these articles. I've written five, all five of these ones. These are the images that it came up for me. Ten, nine articles here. I have not written all of these articles. I've only written two. I've written five articles here, eight articles here, and I have not written any of these. So all of these are written That's 30 some articles. And I want to show you my billing so that you guys can actually see. Let me go over here. So here is my usage. I started this in August. I'm going to show you. So I wrote several articles in August and it cost me five bucks. And then in September, I wrote the rest of those articles and it cost me under $9. So I've written 30 some articles for less than $15. Um, now granted, I did upgrade and I am paying the $50 a month. And the reason I am doing that, if it, it makes it so much easier to actually come over here because these were all posted. Let me see, I've got these. None of these are posted, they're all ready right now. 
what you can actually do with these though is you can come over here and you hit publish to CMS. When you publish, you get to pick your connection. So if I wanted to publish these to my personal blog, I would keep them in draft mode. And then I would select obviously the categories that I have set up. Now I don't, let me see what I have. Yeah, I have different things set up. You could pick the category that you want them to be posted to. I leave this blank and then I hit publish and it will automatically take all of these articles right here with the image and it's going to publish this on my blog and keep it in draft mode ready for me to publish. Now, what I do with AI content is I, you do want to go through and obviously edit it to personalize it, make sure some of your own personal expertise is weaved in there, make sure, you know, it sounds, tone of voice sounds like you. Um, you want to make it, you don't want to, you don't ever want to publish directly AI content. So I go through and I simply, um, make it, you know, sound better and things like this. So all of these right now are posted, which I will actually show you guys this blog. I wanted to show you this. So I started doing this at the beginning of August and I basically have published a post every day this past month, which is every day in September. And I just noticed I've gotten over a hundred pages indexed now in my, this is, this is as of yesterday, my traffic or my impressions are starting to go up, which that means that my pages are starting to get shown in Google when people search for certain key terms. Now, as those impressions go up, I'm going to get more and more clicks to my website, which will then lead to sales for things that I sell. Um, or digital products or services or just anything that's on my website. If I run ads, it will give me impressions to ads and I will earn revenue to that. So this is really starting to work and I'm excited to be showing like the results as, as we move forward um, and publish more and more on this website. I'm really excited in another month or two just to see how many clicks I'm getting from this and then what the conversions are on this traffic. Um, but all of these articles started here and the ones I just published this past week are already getting indexed and I'm already actually getting clicks from the traffic on that, which is really, it's just kind of awesome. <laughs> and you can either let machine pick your keywords for you, or if you're using the paid version of this, you will be able to come over here and click this. And when you do, um, let's see, dogs. Uh, we'll do senior dogs. I'll just do uh, people looking for relief of their relief of pain for their dogs. Because older dogs get obviously, you know, people will be looking for joint health. But what I wanted to show you is like manual, when you click manual, you can actually, this is the paid version, you can put in up to 50 keywords that you want to write articles around. So maybe I've done some keyword research and I found that, wow, you know, orthopedic beds for senior dogs is really good. And that's a keyword I want to put in here. You can put up to 50 of them and then you can include, I don't typically include titles but I would put in as many keywords as you wanted and then you could say, go ahead and cluster this together and it will bring back what you want. So like an example of me, this, I actually put these keywords in. So social media post ideas. I wanted to have an article on Monday, social media post ideas, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I wanted one for every day of the week. This actually wrote that, it interlinks them I said, hey, publish this over to my CS, uh, CMS, um, my WordPress blog, and then I put it in draft mode. I went through, edited, make sure there were some personal things, did some images, optimized them a little bit, and then got them ready for publish. And we published those all last week, and every single one of these pages, I think, got indexed. And then I'm starting to see impressions on each of them, meaning people are searching these keywords that I put in here in my my website is showing up and that, that just kind of confirms that this is pretty cool. And I actually really just, I liked these images. I mean, they are what they are. Um, my, my site looks like kind of 
futuristic and I'm using all AI images. So this matched really well, but you can actually go through a lot of these. I don't know what they all mean, but you'd have to play with them. Images don't cost very much. So like here's a future, let's see, glitch art. I don't know what that is. They have futurism, but then you can pick the different colors. So I actually had some articles written around YouTube. I used the color red. When I wrote a couple articles on um, Amazon, I used gold. When I used Twitter, I used black. So you can change the color of each image that comes back. But like I said, I wrote all of these articles and this only cost me, um, you know, $1.50 on this day, $1.70. This was my most expensive day of $2.42. But I mean, I've spent less than $15 using the API to write all of these blog posts for me. And they're all published here. And you can see like yesterday was the first day where I was like, oh, wow, I just got a bunch more pages indexed and a bunch more impressions. That means clicks are coming. And you want clicks over to your site, obviously, so that you can generate revenue. So if you want to test out Machined, I mean, I highly recommend just getting at least the free version and hooking up your API and testing it out. And then if you have any questions, of course, just ask me. But their support is awesome, too. Um, and then also, if you guys want all of my tools and resources, which is this spreadsheet right here. If you'd like to have access to this, you can click the link in the uh, description below and join our weekly free trainings. I do trainings every Wednesday at one o'clock PM Eastern time. And I answer questions. We go more into depth. I show more of my websites and what's working and what, you know, what progress I'm making every week. And I show people my traffic stats straight out of Google. Um, but I do that more in closed door setting and it's completely free. So subscribe to the channel. If you liked this video, give me a like, comment below. If you have any questions, grab this, um, this, uh, Google spreadsheet. If you want access to all the tools and resources that I use to build businesses. But like I said, this software right here is really cool. So anyway, we'll see you guys on the next video.